the one and only Xalophony here to battle some ancient Chinese warriors against each other. We have Suten versus ancient warriors who used to be Senka but are now renamed. We're gonna see how they go and see which archetype is number one because they both got some new support recently and we're gonna see how it goes. I believe oh, they're yeah. at least both, you know, of Chinese mythology and lore. But regardless, I will let you go first, sir. I know mine certainly is. Well, we got some monsters to work with. We got one of those. We can play, we can play. Oh, All right, no. I'll play the field spell first. Two as one. Yes. Then I'll add the kicking guy. Okay. Then I play fusion deployment, which allows me to reveal one of the one of the fusion materials and special summon it from oh, the man. deck. So fresh, I don't even got the textures yet. Let's go. We did play with this a while back, but I'm thinking it might have gotten some updates over the time. Oh, yeah, because mm. all the cards now have their English text now. Yeah, that too. I guess they're keeping Sutin in the English then. Maybe. All right. Uh, let me see. Then, let's normal summon the kicking guy. I can add a trap to the hand. I think I'm going to add mm, two tin returns. That sounds like a good one. All right. Now, what am I missing to bring out one of these fusion-y boys? I know you don't use polymerization at all for these. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. I just need to use student calling. There we go. Send away to summon a monk to bring out some tokens. Nice. All right. Let's bring out the new guy, actually. Using suits and kicks, spirit token, and a spirit token. Oh. Me, uh, me Gaio, empowered general of the suits in. Pretty then cool. I can bring out another. Ooh, I can bring out the pair right now. Uh oh. I don't know what this means, but they look tough. Well, I wasted my entire hand to bring these guys out, so I hope they're good. <laughs> At the end of the turn, they go to your graveyard, though. Do they? No. <laughs> I've made that up. <laughs> I would have been so sad, Zylo. <laughs> Man, those tokens. All right. Okay, the tokens go to your graveyard. Okay, cool. We did get a continuous card. Mono drop down. Ancient Warrior Saga. Three visits. Okay. That'll help support me once I start getting these guys moved out. Although, I don't have a lot of great stuff to get them all moving. Which is the problem. But, let's see. I think this will be important. Uh, but, we need to get some stuff moving here. All right, that's not going to be of any use. That could be of minor use. I don't see a massive play coming through here. And what's this? Let me do this. Let's me add an ancient warrior monster to my hand, which could be helpful. Could help me destroy something. So we just need to summon something. Um, that one lets me get another spell. This one. I guess that'll be our summon. The Yuzhuan, come on out, buddy. Also gets the uh, three visits card activated. I guess that lets me add another card to my hand. Um, what can break you? Well, this can break one of your cards, at least. So that could be good. I think you have some degree of protection, though. Uh, what do you do? Let's see. Da -da -da, two attacks on monsters. That's not going to be enough now, is it? So let's get this, boyo. Get Guan Yu. And then we'll, uh... Oh, can we not summon him? I thought we could. Okay, that's a problem then. Um, well, let's go ahead and use this. And we need to send a card to the graveyard. So, that will be... Hmm, I think we're just gonna go for this play. Um, if you... Oh, if only your opponent controls a monster. Got it! So, we'll hold on to that. We'll, uh, send... Let's see, they're all good things. Yeah, we're getting lower on cards, so let's send this boy to the grave. I can destroy your monster using the new general. Great. Ah. 
Oh wait, no, I'm summoning anyway, so not great. Uh, but what we will do is sure. What's this boy do? This card is uh, added from the deck to the hand. Well, that's not it. Um, yeah, we're just special summoning some guy for free. You know, let's just bring out one of the tough guys. Let's get out Zhang Du. Welcome to the field, sir. And I believe... Um, yeah, that's not going to let me do a ton. Let's see. We can activate this card. So he gets two attacks. Lovely. And I think I'm going to hold on to my other cards. This guy's big and tough. Yeah. Uh, so who do I hate more? This one returns one monster control of the hand. This one returns all spells and traps, which I don't like, and quick effect to destroy the monster, which you've already used that, so let's get rid of this guy. Ow. Once per turn, fusion monsters I control cannot be destroyed by battle. That's nice. I got two attacks. Well, these are better than double pure... Yeah, attack. better than wiping your field, so... Oh, I get to activate something. Oh man. Oh. I think this guy gets to come back to the hand. Ooh, okay, so you're not empty. Um, unfortunately, that's where we have to end right here. And, uh... My attack goes back down. Maybe then I, I activate Suits and Returns. My oh, my come on. Help the haunted. Bringing back the general. Well done. Then let's activate Fusion Deployment once more. Revealing the Mi Gaio. To bring out the kicking guy once more. Very good. Activating his effect. Get to add another trap to the hand. I think I'll add the duty to the hand. <laughs> duty. Duty, duty, duty. Very nice. Put this down. Activate this real quick, which will allow me to get a token. The normal summon. You he of the Sushin Fits. You see. So it seems you're doing all right. There you ah, go. come on. <laughs> <laughs> then I activate this one, which allows me to tribute the spirit token for its cost. To add a suit and spell a trap card. Very nice. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna add in the calling once more. Okay. Although I don't think I can activate it right now because yeah, I don't have a card to discard. So what I'll do is I'll just attack. Luckily, your power up wasn't permanent. So yep, it's only during my turn. I'll have so be it. Then I'll have everyone just start punching and kicking you. Nice. One of them has steel-toed boots, by the looks of it. Or is that platinum steel boots? It's so armored. So. It's gonna hurt no matter what. Mm-hmm. Alright, and then I end the turn. Alright. Let's see. Do we play that option? Maybe. Um... Let's see, because that technically would work. Uh, do I even have that card in here? I do have this card. You know what? We'll save that as a backup plan. We're going to activate this boy. Let him come out for free. So we got a nice, powerful monster on the field. All right. Oh, yeah, I forgot to play these cards first. Um, so let's see. What does his activation do? I can target one monster your opponent controls and destroy it. Lovely. So we'll just go for that now. And, uh, well, I mean, it's gonna, I'm gonna be stopped regardless, aren't I? Yeah. Or not. Uh, okay. He gets to come back to the feet, back to the hand. Oh. Yeah. I'm surprised you were able to do that. Me too. It literally says the first time each suit and fusion monster you control would be destroyed by battle. It's not. Well, that part's not the part I was worried about. Of course, you're going to be destroyed because um, it's card effect. I was thinking right. you were going to use your quick effect to destroy me. No, it didn't prompt me to. I wonder okay. if anything you have prevented it. Um, I don't know. But let's see. What shall I do now? Um... That could be fun. Because that could certainly work. Yeah, why not? Um, 
Well, we're just gonna bring that back anyway, but more the merrier. Let's summon this boyo. Waiting on you? Uh, yeah, I'm trying to figure out when is the best time to do this. Ooh. Get that out. This will allow me to get another card. And another card to my hand. Now we'll see if we can grab that same boy as before. Assuming I have extra copies in the deck. Yeah, because he just needs two or more cards out, so we'll do that. Fantastic. We'll just go ahead and activate him to summon him, I suppose. I imagine that's how I do it. Mm hmm. Go right there. He's looking nice and juicy. And then, what can I do on top of all this? Oh, yeah, I needed to do this first. What was I thinking? Oh, well, we're okay. Um, this can give me another Ancient Warrior spell card. You know what? We will do that. I will normal summon Lu Jing. And it's not count as a continuous spell card? Hmm. Well, I don't know what's going on. Do we go for this right now? Because that sounds fun, but I also have plenty of fun cards to just attack things with on the field. Uh, this, let's see. Can send one card from my hand to the graveyard, target a face-up card, return it to the hand. That's not all that good. Let's see. If all, uh, okay, I'll gain attack, and I can use each of the effects of this one's per turn. If this card is link summoned, I can add an ancient warrior from my deck to my hand. That's good and all. But is it what I need right now? I guess not. Honestly, a better bet would just be to clear your spell cards. So let's do that. Tornado Dragon. Let's do that. Um, I don't know what the back row thing is. It's probably threatening. And that I know is just going to be some problems. But not too many problems. So yeah. What the back row? I guess I have to activate it. Sutin's Duty. What this allows me to do is basically play a card... Play, basically, this card becomes a copycat of any spell or trap card in my graveyard. Nice. And I think I'm going to choose... Yeah, I'm going to choose my suit and calling. Get some tokens. Yep. More of a wall of defense. And then it allows me to immediately fusion summon. Oh, wonderful. That's actually huge. As long as you can yeah. get a second uh, fusion monster on the field, you're in good shape. And then doing this. Using these two to bring out the original two suit and monsters. Oh. And this one allows me to target Daddy. a card and destroy it. Oh, dang, I can't choose your Zong Z. Uh, I guess not. Must be why you couldn't uh, do the things earlier. Yeah. Uh, or maybe it's your loyal, actually, thinking about it. Could be. Okay. Uh, I'll destroy your... Yeah, I guess I'll destroy your... You know, the field spell doesn't really matter in the long run. So... Yeah, I think I'll just destroy your loyal one. Alright. Fire enough. Uh, let's see. Oh, and then I can negate your Tornado Dragon's effects until the end of the turn. <laughs> sure, why not? Alright. Now... Caught in a dilemma here. Because I think I have a move to do, but it's a very bad move. Oh? Yeah. Darn it. Okay. So, if I activate my effect, I can attack you twice and destroy your monster, but if I activate my effect, you destroy me with your effect. Because that's what prompts it. Mm -hmm. So I can't activate an effect. That's sad. Okay. Well, Tornado Dragon, attack the one that you can overpower here. And then that is... Let's see, what is that? One of monsters... Remali control two Remali control. Um, first time each suit and monster would be destroyed by battle, it is not. Yeah, I guess we just go for the one we can actually break here. Yeah, the one that has lower attack points. Yep, still leaves you with a field full of options, though. Okay. Yep. Uh, this, is the, this is a close duel, actually. It's not terrible, is it? Um, no. 
like we're oh, we're close on life points. We both are like destroying each other quite mm -hmm. evenly. Luckily, I do have another suit and calling, so. Okay. So I'll do this. And can I, I can do anything with the tokens by themselves? Yes, I can use the tokens by themselves. I can bring out another fist, which will allow me to special summon. Just basically replacing it out. So okay. I can get that fresh summon effect. Oh, I can target him now. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, um, well... Yeah, just that. Oh man, that Migyo. So good. Because if I do that, then I still yeah. die. Yeah, no, nah, it's over. <laughs> These guys are not the strongest, but the fact that they can, uh, that the, with the new guy to help them live longer just means no, yeah, by so all much means. more. And yeah, there's that free pop that I've been afraid of. Yeah, and even if I did only leave two alive, then you would have still had a head game right there. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. All right. What do you think about the new support for both these decks? Um, you're certainly definitely tying everything together. I want to see what mine does. In fact, I forget what mine is, but we'll see. I think it's uh, I think it's technically your strongest monster. Okay, that guy. Yeah. We'll see if we can get some use out of him here. I'll go second once again. Is he? I can't remember if he's easy or hard to summon actually. Uh, we'll see. It's all good. I got a lot more. Um, <laughs> last time I had a you handful of monsters. This time I have a handful of spells and traps. Okay. I'm just going to play this so it's not always prompting me. Okay. I'm going to say... Uh, what was the name of your deck? Ancient Warriors, right? <laughs> yeah. It's not letting me look at the name. Well, I have a monster reborn in here. You can get rid of that. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I don't have Monster Reborn in mine either. No. You don't um, use the field spells either, do you? No. I mean, right. I think I have them in here, but I don't think I have Terraforming. Oh. Okay, so you don't have Terraforming? I forgot that's how what it did. I know. I remember I put this in here because I was trying to go online with it, and I was trying <laughs> to get rid of, like, uh, Terraformings and all that because field spells are still nasty even today's that's day true. and age. Yeah, they, they just make decks run. They had to ban uh, Fairy Dragon because it was too good at searching out field spells. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'll summon out Yuhi. Alrighty. And unfortunately, I kind of have to force his hand. I don't mind if it. By destroying himself, I can get a suit and calling to the hand. Nice, nice. Using the suit and calling, of course, I discard one card. I'll discard the kicks to bring out some tokens. Sure. Fortunately, by getting rid of the kick, I do give up the means of the ultimate fusion monsters. Ah, uh, okay. It's a lot of tokens, though. Yeah. Using these two, I'll bring out the, the punching, the Gaia, and I'll bring out the Gawain. Okay. And with that, I'll end the turn. Let's see, I got hand, this in I... my hand, and I don't see a lot of use for it against you, so we're just going to pop it. Oh. All right. Hey, good timing. There, there goes my copycat trap card. Yep. Hey, I did draw a monster. Sweet. Okay. And I also did uh, start off with a little bit of this action. Tanky, so we can get another level four. Uh, yes, I'd like to add something to my hand. What about this guy? Ooh. Let's see. Suj Kong. This one. If he's added to my... By the effect of an Ancient Warriors card, so he won't get as cool effects, so let's not grab him. What about this guy? He was cool before. Um, Send one card from your hand to your graveyard. Special summon Ancient Warrior from your deck. Yeah, sure. He sounds fun. Um, but what does this boy do? Sun Mo. You can send a card um, from your hand to the graveyard. Add one to your hand, yeah, except blah, 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 blah. So, I think we're actually going to go for this, because I know I can get a play off it right now. But first, of course, of course, of course, we got to get three visits out here. Um, we also have East by South Winds. And we will normal summon 
Yes, boy. You do certainly have more variety of spells and. Uh, oh no, yeah, the continuous spell variety in here is great. And ooh, this. Um... Oh, imagine this guy, these guys with hum like you just ran one Haman in here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's try to get the new guy, but I think I might be able to just do that. Let's see. Send one card from your hand to field to the graveyard. Special summon one ancient warriors except this guy. Okay, so let's... Because I know I can summon this guy. So we'll do that. And we'll just try to summon that by this effect. So we'll do this. We're going to get rid of a tanky. Because it has been used. And then we will go for... The new boy. If I can spot him. Oh, he's not on this list. Okay. So I should have searched him with the other effect. Oh well. Maybe he's something named slightly different. We'll, uh, we'll grab a Guan Yu for later. Oh wait, he summons automatically. Sweet! So we're gonna get the... There we go. Get the two big warriors right out here off the bat. Alrighty. That sounds excellent. We'll set this card, because why not? And we'll turn these two level sevens into a big guy and take you over. No. <laughs> that, wouldn't be the, that wouldn't be the worst idea, but at the same time... Mm hmm you're able to consistently bring out that big guy pretty easily. Yeah. Let's see. What an attack is that? Then I can uh, draw a card. Oh, sweet. Thank you. You definitely have the stronger field right now because I, I wasn't able to bring out the big guy. Yeah, I feel like you have bigger end game plays. I have better consistency. That might be where we're looking at right here. Because mm -hmm. um, like, even I have cards in my hand right now. I can still play even if this field is wiped. At least the monsters. <laughs> Yeah, and the worst thing is you you got rid of my back row suits in return, which would allow me to basically yeah. play the spell card again. Exactly. But you want to know how bad it is right now? I think you just win right now. Yeah, no, I imagine you don't have anything after that. All right. So those timers go. And now we can summon this boy, see what happens. Neat. That'll let me uh, search another card. And this, hopefully... Okay, we can get the rebellious Lu Fang. And then okay, he can be special summoned as long as I have the strongest monster on the field. So that's pretty cool. Big tough monster. And uh, is there any smart plays for me to do here? What's this one do? When this card declares an attack, you destroy one card your opponent controls. Um oh, I do this to a monster? I don't know, let's activate and see what happens. Oh, okay, flip the coin and then stuff happens okay so what does that do can i not activate effects anymore or something i think so sure um yeah and just because i have extra cards to work with right here let's just mess around and bring this out and that i believe just searches me whatever card i want it does lovely so, the thing I'm trying to figure out about this new guy, the Rebellious Lufant, mm -hmm. it says while you can control a monster with the highest attack among the Ancient Warriors, yeah. does that mean if you control one Ancient Warrior that has high attack points? You can I think it around? does, yeah. So, I just want to see, like, when you have stuff on the field, what happens, you know? Yeah. So, we'll toss that, and then, yeah, I can freely add to my hand whoever I want here. So, theoretically, can I do this more than once a turn? Because I just added another. No. Oh. And that goes off as well. Uh, no, okay, I don't think I can do it more than once a turn. So, but look at look at the field. Look at what we got over here. Not bad at all. Let's just uh, we'll let the new boy hit you with the 45. And, oh, he has a, another effect to activate. Let's see, quick effect. Destroy one face-up monster your opponent controls with the high stat. Well, that's not going to be a thing. I'll just use it anyway. Oh, I can destroy card. <laughs> Trap trick. Yeah, it's mainly good for getting out that uh, yeah. copycat card. Alright, yeah, well, we definitely did that a lot more smoothly this time. Let's see who wins the third match. Third and, there, and there's your Link monster, by the way. I don't know if that's new or not. I don't remember either, but it's helpful. Mm -hmm. I'll go second this time, get that extra draw in. Alrighty. See if I can respond to your stuff. Mm hmm. What is my play here? Because I don't exactly have something I can summon. We'll activate this. But I think that might be that. 
Let's see. Yeah, send this card uh, to your graveyard during your second standby phase after activation once per turn. Toss a coin. If the result is had, send it to the graveyard. If this card is sent from there, you can activate this effect. Okay, so it's really just fodder for me to send with the other cards for the most part and get an extra benefit off of it. That's not bad, um, but I don't have any means of summoning an Ancient Warrior card, so I will have to end my turn. All right. Hmm. Let's see. Okay, this can work. So I summon a summon a monk. Mm hmm Activating his effect. I'll send away my cross out designator. Yeah, fair. Gotta love those sometimes useful, but mainly can be used for fodder. To bring out the suits and fists. Okay. Who I can then activate targeting himself to get the suits and calling to my hand. Here we go. Which I'll then activate by discarding a card like the Trident Warrior. The Trident Warrior is in there because one of the suits and warriors is a level is a level three. And I can mm -hmm. use Trident Warrior as fodder for it. Okay. The Night Fusion Summon. Let's use the suits in, in the hand to bring out the Heavenly General. Then, you don't exactly have a monster. No, I really now, don't. But I'll still bring him out for attack points, though. Yeah. I'll still activate my terraforming to get the field spell. Darn it, man. Good start off you. Mm-hmm. Add a suit tin to the hand. Yes, please. I'll add in the kicks. All right. Now, let's just go for some attacks. All right. This is definitely going to hurt you. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you don't have the one that, you know, reacts off my uh, card effects to uh, do that. But this guy has not the gate, right? Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. boy. Let's just bring out a token. <laughs> just scare you. Oh, yeah. That, no, I'm still looking at Heavenly General's effect. Oh, it's only a uh, spell that targets that card that you get to negate it. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately. Sure, we can live with that. Okay, well, good thing I didn't accidentally click that card first. We want to put three visits out here. Um, I might as well put this out here. Actually, I probably shouldn't have done that, but it's fine. We got Tensu out there, and we can activate Guan Yun. Get him to go out there, because I can only summon him when you have monsters. Mm -hmm. And fortunately, that'll let me get my three visits off. Um, now, I could grab this card right now and see if I can actually get out the Rebellious Lufang. Or I could bring out a card that'll help me here. That's the tough part. Um, let's see. Probably should go for something that's going to be a little classier. Let's see. So this will let me get any Ancient Warrior Spell or Trap card to my hand. And I can negate one of your monster's effects. Oh, that's nice. Problem is, you got more attack than me. Mm hmm. Hmm. The thing is, I never understand this. Who you. is it? Oh, okay. It's the suit and fist. Okay. That's who I, was, this who I was looking boy? at powering up. Yeah, this is our boy. Alright, we're gonna get this guy. And then we can normal summon him. I mean, sure. Do it by way of this, because we did play the card. And then it's waiting on you. Yeah, I think I'm going to mess you up a little bit. Sure. By activating Exorcism, I can send away my fists to destroy one card on your side of the field. Ooh, okay. I got to choose your loyal. Okay, thankfully you did that at least. Then I can draw an extra card for it. Okay. And Jeez. when that happens, I can activate my suiting kicks, special summoning it in defense mode. If you get to fusion something right here, I'll be so upset. Ah, uh, <laughs> and you get that guy out as well? Yeah, because yeah, I used the kick sky for it. <laughs> Alright. Um, so. Much the return. dream team is back on the field. <laughs> yeah. Okay, control two or more. You can destroy that monster anytime an effect is activated. Lovely. On the opponent's field. Okay, okay. Let's see, because this I can activate my effect and help, but it's also another desperate play I can make, but I don't know if it'll work. 
Um, but let's go check it. Um, oh, I don't even know if it will work. Because that would require me to... Uh, in theory. Yeah. I have no clue. <laughs> but we're going to go for the desperation play. All Sometimes right. your desperation plays mess me up bad. Oh, yeah. Uh, first, we'll start by playing uh, this. Oh, that did not get rid of it. Here, we'll activate this one. Then. Just need to get rid of that. Lovely. So that I should really check what this does. All right, let's see. Sent to the graveyard. You can act this turn. Your opponents can't activate cards in response to my ancient warrior's card effects. Ooh, I think that'll put this one in the clear. So I guess oh. we might as well learn if it does or doesn't. Um, and that I should special summon. Uh, Zhang Du will certainly be the power I need, and I don't want to go activate an effect, so let's just do that. Alright, so that did in fact work. Um, that should in theory then work as well, so he gets his two attacks. And then do we still bother a desperation play? We don't have to. Um, however, I can still make a good play. Ow. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Remember what he does? Okay. Whatever. The one, the one thing you were saying that I'm scared of the, uh, the Miguel's uh, effect. Yeah. Was, you know, obviously I didn't want to use Summoner Monk's effect, but you don't exactly get a choice. <laughs> so, yeah. we'll just Apparently, go for battles. Apparently, from what this card art is saying, I think they're going to be, I think Sutin's going to be renamed actually to dual avatars. Hmm. Okay. Oh, you get your double attack, right? Yep. Thanks to the effects of uh, East by South winds. And when his copy is destroyed, I get to bring out. I get to bring that back to the hand. Yep. Unfortunately, that's where I'm gonna have to leave it because, well, that's where I'm gonna have to leave it. I could do that and nah. Yeah, unfortunately, I think you're gonna be able to rebound pretty nicely here. Ooh. Just because of all the return power. Mm-hmm. First off, I'm going to normal summon the fist. Activate this so I can get a token so I can use that as a cost instead. Lovely. Sending that away. And let's get the... Oh, I just cost one? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, okay. That wasn't the fusion. That was just the search. But that one, however. And get destroy card on the field. Let's get rid of your Valiant. Mm-hmm. Set this card down. And let's start kicking your monster. Alright. I guess it's not hopeless yet. Well, you still got the card down there, which is... I think it's the one that brings you back a monster. Um, okay, <laughs> this will go off, which I think just forces it, unfortunately. Um, I got this. But it doesn't win the duel for me, does it? Nope. Good card in that scenario, but not good enough. You take the day, Mario. Just barely. Yeah. <laughs> These guys are good with this new guy. Like, this guy just adds what they needed. Like, the No, 100%. Yeah, your other guy, he had, like, a very specific negate. This guy's just like, yeah, activate an effect, see what happens. And I'm like, I can't. <laughs> or you'll wreck me. Yeah, and it's, I can choose when to. You uh, you can't just bait it out. Like, you activate, oh, I'm going to activate this small little monster effect. You mm -hmm. can totally use that on it. Nope. Yeah, the I'm timing is perfect. So, mm -hmm. the shooting, the Sutans do so well and manage to beat the Legendary Warriors. But both decks are certainly improved. I do like the new card. Um, it just, your new card happens to counter. My new card is the problem. Yeah, but you still, that didn't mean that they were perfect, though. You saw what happened when you were able to clear out my, my weaker field. Yeah. And you just got swarmed me hard. If you don't have the right cards, you're in a lot of trouble. Me, I can kind of bounce off a little bit of it. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed this duel. If you have, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything else and leave a like on this video. We'll see you next time. See you, folks.